Harry disguised as a decorator, infiltrated the casino and secretly added a countdown timer to the casino's electric gates, set it to blow up the casino's electric gates half an hour later, and then, bend the coat hangers, tape the small lens to the hook, tie a small rope to the hanger, wait for the manager to leave the office, he avoids the cameras, hanging the hanger above the camera, while the lenses are blocking the camera, he rushed to the office with the small rope, pulling out the lock picking tool in his pocket, ready to unlock the door, at that moment the guard was looking at the surveillance camera, and noticed that it was blocked, so he immediately ordered someone, to see what was going on, with the lock on the door, was picked open, Roy was inside the office in a flash, before the guards arrived, yanked off the coat rack, locking the door behind him, and the guards didn't notice anything unusual about the surveillance, after the guards had left, Roy picks up the ashtray on the coffee table, grabbed a handful of ashes, and sprinkled it on the foyer, the hidden laser shield in the entrance hall, immediately became visible, Roy took a look, oops, Roy immediately ripped off a lamp and stuck it to the laser emitter, the laser was then locked into the lamp, Roy folds the lamp over the top, then he carefully crossed the entrance hall, to the steel door of the chamber, the purpose of his trip was to steal the 1.5 billion dollar worth of diamonds,